Welcome back to the channel again. Okay. Today I'm going to to do some stupid DIY thing on my BMW C400X. The one I'm going to to do is the DIY for coding on the display. I'm using this one now, the ESIS program. So I'm going to coding the, the display of BMW GS. It's become like this. Show you this this one. Uh, it's after I coding this one. It's become with the alarms happens on my dashboard, my uh, TFT display. What I'm going to prepare have uh, one. It's uh, the battery charger. And the cable for ODB2, OBD2, this cable, and the software. So what I have done at the moment for uh, for the first time. Let's see. Cancel. See, this place look like this. Very nice. It's GS display and it's have RMP here and the speed here. Okay, very nice. Okay, and I'm going to the first page on the menu. Alright, my vehicle. Something problems because it's a uh, it's unmatching okay it's become have adventure that's why um, we don't have an adventure in this this model navigation still okay still working media and phone still working assisting it change AC is missing we don't have AC it's become an alarm system uh, blah 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 this is not for us setting okay this one is normal language also normal alright and Connection, uh, I have checked is done properly, no problems. Uh, this way a little bit more, more model, more modern and very nice. And okay, the tank to thirty cent. It is for GS actually. All right. Speed limit. Oh, we don't. We don't have speed limit actually. Information. The license. The license still uh, belong to uh, my my uh, C four hundred X license version. No problems. All right. Let's see after start. Or it's this, okay? You see, we have RPM is come come over here. Okay, I'm riding.
Uh, it's not too bad actually. But yeah, okay. I'm going to to learn more how to to do it in in next part. Okay. So you see this one it's 400 x is missing all right i'm going to make it in another part if i have done something i will update soon thank you for watching goodbye